back to the Maple Brick Academy on the wall series. Today we're on an interior wall dealing with a common problem that we come across quite a bit, uh, dusting of an interior wall. So your brick wall such as this, covered with plaster, the plaster has come off over the years because of moisture, uh, probably through, these, through the interface between the window and the wall. And uh, so the plaster has fell off. Uh, we've got a pretty rough wall but even on a wall without plaster, especially uh, down in the historical trench quarter in New Orleans, we have a lot of dusting off onto the floor, off onto the beds. So it's quite a problem. The, the problem you have with putting something on an interior wall is it needs to be breathable. You can't put a film former on an interior wall because the moisture is going to get trapped behind it and most likely it will fail or blush. Uh, so as you can see, the, the wall itself, when you, it's, it's pretty rough. So we're going to be applying today Prosecco's interior, interior masonry dust proofer in uh, a wet on wet application. And it's a, it's a silicone based product. It's breathable uh, and it should last for many years. So what, what we're going to do now is attempt to show you uh, what the problem is. So we've covered this table with a piece of black plastic and as you rub this wall You can see the dust coming down off of the, the mortar joints uh, creating a, a Maintenance mess for for an owner of a property either on the carpet or on the bed um, And th this is what we're trying to uh, To deal with with the masonry dust proofer so what we'll do next is apply some material, let it cure, and then we'll come back and check it again. Welcome back. So now we're gonna apply the Prosecco interior masonry dust proofer. Uh, it, it's not diluted. You use it right as it comes uh, in, the, in the bottle. Start from bottom to top. Uh, you want a six to eight inch rundown. Evenly saturate the surface because we're trying to bind up all these particles. So you want to ease, evenly saturate the surface. Try to create a rundown. Now this wall is really porous. So I'm going to slow down to try to create that rundown. This is a water-based silicone product so you can clean up after you apply with uh, Prosecco 2010 All Surface Cleaner. After cured, it's going to be a little bit harder to clean it up. I'm going to go ahead and spray on this plaster to show you how it also will help on your on your plaster dust. Wet on wet application means you let it soak into the wall, and as soon as it's soaked in, you reapply, and that that gives you a better coat. Uh, there's no smell pretty much no smell to the dust proofer. So that's something that you don't have to deal with. Just keep in mind, the point of this is it's a breathable product. So we're not trapping moisture in the wall. In the second coat, as we stated earlier on other uh, projects on the wall, second coat always goes on faster than the first coat because we've already saturated the surface. We're looking for still for that six to eight inch rundown. There's probably going to be some slight darkening to this wall. So we will come back after three days, it's fully cured in 72 hours. We'll come back and run our brush over it and, and check our progress. Okay, we're back on the wall here at the, at the uh, test spot for the interior masonry dust proofer. We're gonna check the performance of the dust proofer. 
we applied the dust sprucer from the corner to approximately right here. We see some darkening, but that was to be expected. Uh, a little more obvious on the, on the plaster from here down. Uh, we're gonna brush on both sides to see what we gained on the dusting. But before we do that, I'll do, I'll do this. So this was treated. And as you can see, there's virtually no dust on my fingers. The plaster on this side, untreated, as you can see, we're still picking up a lot, we're picking up a lot of dust. So on the plaster part of this, we definitely gained ground. So we're gonna brush the treated side first. Little to no dust coming down on our, on our black plastic. And our brush is picking up very little dust. So now we're gonna move over here. So we're gonna brush from here over to here. We'll catch some of it on the table. So untreated, treated. So we're getting a lot of dust off this side and the plaster as we've already shown is dusting. And so we picked up a lot of material on this side. So as you can see, a lot of dust coming off of this wall. So the interior masonry dust proofer did a really good job so we have a good product, breathable product, uh, silicone-based product uh, that can definitely help on interior dust problems. Mm -hmm.